Everybody, in this episode, we are going to add the OR gates over here. So, if you are missing your AND gate design, that came in the last part, and a video will be popping up over there. So, go back and watch that. So, it took us one chip, two chips to do two AND chips to get these five gates going. You'll notice we have three gates here that are or gates and so we're going to match this will be number one that'll go from there uh, this will be number two that'll be these two and this will be three there okay so first thing we need to do bring in an or gate or or chip power it ground it don't forget powers 14 all right so we're switching over here and you'll notice uh, we don't have enough space. So I want to grab an or, or chip. So I got it right, or meat. And a quad or gate at that. And if I put it on there, you'll notice it'll run into there. So let's grab another breadboard. on here that Let's close that and a small breadboard bring it on all right and kind of move this over so we can all see um i'm going to ground it and let's do black I'm going to power it. Let's do red. And actually, I'm going to do the same thing down here. So let's do that black. Let's do that red. And let's move this down here. Um, remember that this is pin one, and I, I, I'm used to like viewing things vertically, building them vertically, because I usually build on a breadboard like this. And so this right here is our power. So I'm going to find the power, plug that in on pin 14, make that red, and then pin 7, because it always starts 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, is going to be ground. Okay, so we should be designed and ready to go. Um, again, I'm going to want to put an LED here and test it and see if these work. So um, this was gate two, which was right there. So that's coming out of pin six. So I want pin six to go to pin one. So and... Pin six, one, two, three, four, five, six is an output to or pin one. And then I want to do, um, I want to do, and this is going to be, uh, this is gate th three for me, so gate three. So this is pin eight, as we can see. So eight is going to go here to then, this is going to be on or gate two. So eight here to two here. So I'm going to go eight, which is three, four, five, six, seven. This is eight, an output, that's right. I'm going to go up, down, and around. All right. And then, of course, this is pin three right there. So I'm going to connect this to an LED. So let's take, this is our output of one, and I'm going to go to an LED here. All right. 
now it's time to simulate and check. Another way we can simulate and check is be like, hey, let's let's add an LED here. So this was two. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go from six to here, which says every time VST is plugged in. So let's start playing this. And I'm gonna go VST. Light turns on, light turns on. So that's a good sign. That says that this is on, and this is an OR gate, or this. So now let's go to, I'm gonna put another light here. And this again is coming out of pin eight. So I, I need to stop this. And I'm gonna say, all right, this is pin eight. I, I made that green. And it is saying P and V whenever president and vice president. Okay. So I'm simulating. I press the start simulation. You'll notice P, that one, P and V. All right. So that works and that works. So now every time that works and that works all right it should only work in those combinations and as you can see as i go through the truth table there's one or that okay you'll notice both of them are on and you're like wait how can both be on it's because in this situation when they're all turned on then pv and vst are all on which means both of these lights are on and this one is on. Okay. So this is a great place to take a time out. We are almost done. Uh, we need to add this gate and this gate. We are almost there, everybody. So take a time out, go get a drink of water, come back for the next part.